Let's talk some weather. Hi, Jay. Cold. Yeah. Er. Or colder, cold er. right? Yes. <laughs> so crank up the heater. Hopefully, you get that bad boy going because you'll need it tonight and you'll need it especially tomorrow night heading into Friday because while we're going to be cool tomorrow morning, we're going to be even colder. On Friday, outside right now, a little bit of cloud cover, but we are slowly starting to clear across the area as most of the rain is pretty much departed. We'll put the radar in motion. You can see down toward the south, maybe lower portions of Plaquemines Parish. That's it. The rain has moved out. Now, the clouds a little bit stubborn, and some of the rainfall totals you can see. This is radar indicated where most of the rain was. We had anywhere from one tenth to two tenths over the last 24 hours. That's about it. Not a whole bunch of rain, but cooler air is moving in. These are some of our lows. Notice 55 was low at the airport in Kenner, 56 at the lakefront. And these didn't happen until later on in the afternoon. And some of these occurred uh, right around lunchtime. And these highs actually occurred around midnight or just after midnight. So kind of a flip flop here as colder air continued to filter in. Taking a look at the current temperatures 52 right now in Bogalusa, Hammond 54 in Slidell. 58 in Bell Chase, and we're 58 as well in Galliano. Homa, you're cooling off nicely at 55 degrees. And as you can see, we are cooler, significantly cooler. 11 degrees cooler in Hammond, the airport in Kenner, and as much as 15 degrees cooler at this hour in Slidell with that nice offshore flow. Those are northerly winds running about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Winds will be relatively light for the most part tonight, except near the coast. So, a big area of high pressure at the surface. That's going to continue nudging to the east to southeast. Our front right here, that's going to continue lifting and moving away from the area. And our clearing line, you can see it's near Alexandria with some breaks in the cloud cover. This is going to slowly track toward the east southeast. This is 8 30 this evening. As you can see, no rain, still dealing with a little bit of cloud cover. And I think we do hold on to some clouds overnight tonight through tomorrow morning. So that's why we're not going to cool quite as much. It'll be a different story because by the time we hit tomorrow afternoon, lots of sunshine. And they will go clear skies overnight tomorrow night, heading into Friday afternoon. More sunshine, but that'll allow for optimal cooling. Tomorrow night into Friday, where temperatures are going to be dipping to near the lower 30s on the North Shore. Again, that's going to be on. That's going to be tomorrow night, heading into Friday morning. For tonight on the North Shore, through tomorrow morning, lower 40s. So it's going to be chilly north, even chilly south of Lake Pontchartrain, mid 40s to near 50. It'll be partly to mostly cloudy. Now, if we lose some of the cloud cover, we're definitely going to be cooling off a little bit more than what I'm showing here. But I think this is a pretty good bet. Now, tomorrow afternoon, we are going to have some sunshine. We are going to start off a little bit cloudy. It'll be cool, breezy to the south. Temperatures, upper 50s, lower 60s. That is unseasonably cool after being unseasonably warm. Take a look. A high of 60 on Thursday, 61 on Friday. But notice, 35 Friday morning to the north. A couple of spots could see a little frost north of Lake Pontchartrain, 42. Right They're about to lower 40s south of the lake. And then we slowly moderate temperatures heading into the weekend. Notice that with no rain in the forecast, we'll be partly cloudy mid 60s by Sunday. And by the time we get to Monday, a little disturbance is going to move through. Yeah, maybe a 20% chance of rain. But take a look at your afternoon temperatures. We're roughly going to be staying in the 60s. The average temperature is 67, so we're going to stay slightly below that. Scott and Camille, people want the cold air. It's going to be getting here shortly.